Do you remember a bit of a fundraiser just a few months ago, the Great Pigeon Race, which was certainly inaugural, different, and I guess uh, my next guest is just as different and I think just as inspirational as well. From Moya, Moya Australia, it's Nicola Baker. Good morning. How are you? Good morning, Murray. I'm bright and shiny today. How about you? Oh, enjoying the sunshine, I think, like a lot of people around tropical North Queensland after the rain. It's just beautiful at the moment, isn't it? Uh, sure why we live up in the tropics, that's for sure. The colours of the sky and the grass and the flowers, it's fantastic. It's good to see that you focus on the positives because Moya Moya, you know, it's a difficult subject. It's a disease that's rare. It's a, basically a progressive disorder caused by blocked arteries at the base of the brain. And uh, thankfully, uh, it, it's it's more prominent actually in Asia than what it is, is here in Australia. But obviously, you've got a direct connection. Let's cover that first. Sure. Well, my little boy is ne- nearly 18 years old this year, but he had his first stroke at 11 months old from Moya Moya disease. Um, and it's something that has caused a significant uh, disability in Jed. Um, but uh, although he's palliative and has been for some years, he's still showing us little miracles and we're still giving him every opportunity to live the best life that he can. So... He's taller than his mother now, and that's his main claim to fame at the moment. (laughs) That's great to hear. And, look, I think that's the positivity that we love to hear from you. We're going to talk about the inaugural Blue Tie Ball, which is coming up on the 8th of May in a couple of minutes' time. But just quickly tell me, how did things go? You've had some really exciting stuff that you've been doing, fundraising for Moya Moya Australia, uh, including that great pigeon race that we talked about, a few other things. Let's briefly talk about the success of those. Oh, we are having so much fun. Moi Moi Australia is just kicking goals left, right and centre. Um, we had, of course, the great blue pigeon race, which was absolutely the most hilarious thing I've ever done in terms of fundraising. Yes. Um, who would have thought that a 35 birds could have raised over $7,000 in a profit? So, wow. um, yeah, we had a lot of fun with that. We've got some plans to run the, the race again this year. Um, so we're just going to lock in that date, and as soon as we've done that, I'll let you know, Murray. But we also had the Smoky Blue Car Rally uh, last uh, October, and that's going to run again this year. But then, on top of all of that fun stuff, we've all been accepted as Moy Moy Australia has become a partner with Charity TV Global. So we're actually now fundraising as part of that campaign to raise the awareness of Moy Moy disease raise funds to keep doing the good stuff that we've been doing Um, and at the end of it we'll have this TV show that we'll be able to tell everybody about um, once it's been filmed so it's all exciting. And I spoke to actually Troy Gray uh, who's the producer behind Global TV, Uh, actually no, uh, behind Global, no it's a charity, what's the name of it, Global Charity? Global TV TV. Charity TV Global. That's it. I knew, I knew I had all the words right, but I just couldn't quite get the combination. Oh, Charity TV Global, do it. He's the man behind Charity TV Global, and it really is inspirational. So uh, I believe you've got quite a few people that are keen to be a part of it. It's a really, really exciting thing. But look, what I want to talk to you about specifically this morning, because this is a day claimer, and uh, you're such an inspirational woman, uh, you know, who goes through some amazing challenges. But, you know, I appreciate the fact that you enjoyed the flowers and the trees this morning. And, of course, you know, those, those little miracles that you see every day with your son. But the inaugural Blue Tie Ball is coming up on Saturday the 8th of May at the Pullman Reef Hotel Casino. Tell me about the fun and games that we can expect that night. Oh, everything's going to be so much fun. We've got beautiful Paula from Wedding Treasures who's doing the decorations for us. We've got 4CA and Star are right behind us. The Pullman are giving us a beautiful three-course meal and a free drink on arrival. And I'm very well informed that they are giving us a beautiful blue cocktail so we can all drink blue drinks and have blue lighting and on-call performance and making everything blue. And then we're going to have a few really cool announcements. One of the big things I'm going to show everybody is a project I've been building in my shed. Uh, I never thought I would see myself building a six-foot-long brain, but there you have it. I've been building this. (laughs) <laughs> I've got to push it. I'm going to push it, I hope, from Smithfield to Cairns. So I'm going to have to get the local police uh, involved with yeah. this. But this, this brain is going to be at all of the parades. We're going to be out there pushing it. It's big enough for someone to sit in it. So watch this space. Watch out for the brain and know that that's us from Moya Moya, Australia. 
Excellent. Now, look, uh, I'm really looking forward to the night because uh, I'm going to come along and I'm donating my services uh, as the MC for the night. So it could be an interesting evening, but I know we're going to have a lot of fun. And, uh, of course, the uh, the theme is blue, and uh, particularly for the beautiful blue sky today. But I think uh, everyone will be far from blue. It's going to be a lot of fun. Now, it's $150 per ticket, but, of course, the funds raised on the night going to uh, Moya Moya Australia and such a, a wonderful charity, a wonderful cause. And uh, you can buy tables of 10 uh, so uh, for people that would like to get involved and come along and support this, the inaugural Blue Tie Ball, Saturday the 8th of May, what do we need to do, Nicola? Well, you need to jump online and go to moyamoyaustralia.org.au. Moya Moya is spelt M-O-Y-A, M-O-Y-A, and you'll see a nice big button there that says buy tickets. Um, and when you come along, you'll get that beautiful three-course meal and the drink, but you'll also get to dance to Riley Wilkinson, and to Dr Elephant, and there's a charity auction, and it's just going to be so much fun. Uh, we'll scoot down to PJ O'Brien's for a little bit more fun afterwards. Okay. So it's going to be a massive night. Well, I'll make sure I bring a, a wad full of cash to see what might be available there for the charity auction as well. But look, uh, it's such a wonderful event, and uh, you really are an inspiration for what you do for your son, your family. But, of course, for Moya Moya Australia, I said it's such a such a rare disease. It's not well known, but, of course, it's debilitating. Uh, but you, 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 you're a tower of strength in so many ways. Saturday the 8th of May, uh, go to the Moya Moya Australia website. Just search it if you missed all the details before. Nicola, we're, we're looking forward to the ball and, of course, all the blue-themed things that are happening over the next couple of months. Always wonderful to talk to you. Always awesome to talk to you. and We'll get to have a dance together. What will it be, the chicken dance? As long as it's not the can-can, you should be safe. Otherwise, <laughs> you might have some very sore shins, I reckon. No problem. I'm sure we'll have fun no matter what we do, Murray. Now you can keep it.